This is one of the rarest localities of Bo in captivity. He currently lives in a storage bin. Today he's getting a massive bioactive enclosure upgrade and here's how I did it. He's going to be a little bit of a thicky, so we need to encourage him to get up off the ground to avoid crushing the plants. Drilling holes halfway through the wall will give the expanding foam something to anchor itself to. We want a really chunky substrate that'll let the roots breathe. This is basically my own version of an ABG mix and then I mixed in some topsoil. So we need plants that can withstand a high humidity, don't get too tall and won't get crushed. That leaves us with things like Calathea, Aglaonema, Aspilenniums, Epipremnums, and I went to Home Depot just for the smell, but I've left with this beautiful bromeliad. Powder orange isopods and springtails will make this truly bioactive. We're going to let it marinate for eight weeks and then we're going to edit the video. And this was his live reaction. <laughs> Very excited. He hit his head on the door four or five times. This is a Paraguana Peninsula boa. They're a dwarf locality and they don't get very big. This enclosure is definitely an experiment. I can see him making about a year in here. But many updates to come and I'll see you soon.